Hello, welcome to today's leadership tip. Uh, I'm Penny Eccles and uh, this video is about the day I realised I was a leader. And uh, I'd like you to think about the day you realised that you were a leader. I don't mean the day that you became a manager or a director. Um, I think it's uh, something quite different to realise that you are a leader and that you have leadership potential. So the day I realised was um, after my team had won quite a prestigious award. Um, funny story, which I'll share with you. Uh, it was the night of the awards ceremony. Uh, my team and I didn't think we were going to win, so we were just going to have a really good night. Earlier that night, um, some colleagues of ours had won an award and um, we were totally thrilled for them. So we were in very high spirits, so high that uh, we nearly missed the point at which our name was called uh, for being uh, an outstanding team in our sector. Um, so this is the moment when I say to you that I heard our name, I, I gently stood from the table and I let my team file past me because that's what humble leaders do. Um, but I can't tell you that because I'm only human and that's not what I did. I was so excited uh, that I sprinted to the stage uh, in a way that I've never sprinted before and I'm likely never to sprint again. I had my eye on the prize and the particular prize at the time was Bill Bailey who was hosting the awards and as I ran to the stage with my team behind me I had people from my career um, who were in my sector kind of tapping me on the arm saying well done Penny and I was very much get out of the way <laughs> I, I had to you know rugby tackle uh, Bill Bailey he did look quite terrified as I approached him uh, but we got to the stage and we were just so elated um, it's it's an external endorsement when you win an award, but we'd been through quite a year um, and we'd handled some really um, difficult um, situations and crises and, and we were there and we were winning an award and we were on cloud nine. But I remember looking uh, out into the crowd, uh, Bill Bailey at my side, and I remember having this great sense of unease because I suddenly thought, hmm, uh, these are my team, they're awesome. I'm only here because I'm the director. And did I actually deserve to win this award? Did I even have anything to do with uh, the category entry? Did I really deserve to be there? And as I came off the stage, this feeling stayed with me for a good week. Uh, I'm sure now I know it as imposter syndrome um, and I shared it, I shared the feelings with a, a really trusted colleague and I just said I feel like such a fraud. There I was collecting the award and I didn't deserve to be on that stage and he gave me some great advice and this really was the day I realised that perhaps I was a leader because he said to me um, you absolutely are a leader because you never tell us what to do. You show us what good looks like. Um, you set us parameters, um, but you allow us the freedom and autonomy to get there. Um, you tell us what you think uh, good is and what bad is and that you tolerate failure. Please see my other vlog about permission to fail. And it was at that moment and I thought, yeah, okay, that sounds like a leader. Um, so when did you realize that you were a leader? Have you realized it yet? It's sometimes it's embarrassing to claim that we are a leader, but it's nothing to be embarrassed about. And um, it, it's, it's a compliment to be told that you can lead and that people are prepared to listen to what you have to say. <laughs> 